are learning a lot, a lot, a lot. And um, the elephant in the room or the elephant in the farm. Sasa tumekuja sasa pale ambao wakulima wengi. Tunajua hapa it either do or die. Magonjwa. Please explain to us what are some of the diseases ambazo zina affect spinach from kakiwa kadogo paka kuwa mkubwa. Zingine unapata ziko na spots za black. Iyo ni nini? Zingine zimeza kutan yellow. Uh, kwa mtanda wa TikTok watu wameanza kuuliza mbona spinach yangu iko na a lot of yellowing so the yellowing the you have not cause spots the black uh, how should do I scout for pests and diseases and how and what are some of the uh, best set that you recommend mkulima uh, kitu ya muhimu sana ambaye kale kuna faujo scouting kuna kitu inaitwa scouting ama wewe ukiwa mkulima unafaa kutembea kwa shamba yako mara kwa mara kwa sababu leo mdudu atakuja ama mchana wewe ukitembea huyo mdudu anakuja masaa ile wewe umeenda nyumbani ama ile masaa uko shambani so mara nyingi ukipiga hata dawa masaa ya mchana huyo mdudu hayuko huyo mdudu atarejea masaa za asubuhi na ile masaa za magharibi ile wakati ambapo jua haiwaki sana ndio huyo mdudu anakuwa very active so hiyo scouting ile masaa ambayo unatembelea shamba ujue changamoto ile mimea yako inapitia ni ya muhimu sana. Usi, usije tu ukapita kama umeenda ukaangalia uko na aspirin changu iko maridadi. Kumbe ule mdudu wako pale chini. Anaendelea kungata zile mizizi na nini. Lakini uh, uh, ya muhimu kama hiyo ugonjwa umetaja yellowing. Yellowing mara nyingi sio ugonjwa. Hiyo ni nutrition deficiency. Ukiona majani yananyauka yanakuwa yellow. Mara nyingi ni, kuna kuna baadhi ya zile uh, rubirutubishi inakosea. Eh, na mara nyingi ni nitrogen kwa matawi ambaye mboga za majani ambazo ni za green eh, ili ni ya mwisho hii huenda tu ni, ni, ni matawi ile imezeeka ambaye ina, lakini hii mara hii inaona kama ni nutrition deficiency hii ni kukosa virutubishi fulani lakini pia ni kama uh, udongo pia ilimea chini ya mchanga eh, ikimea chini ya mchanga huenda haipokei ile mwangazo wa kutosha wa kuipatia ile rangi ile photosynthesis hai, hai, hai kuje. lakini mara hii spinach yako kwa sasa naona iko sawa haina challenge kubwa hiyo ugonjwa ambao umetaja ya, ya, ya ring spot ama black spot hizo ni uh, ni fungus eh, tuseme iko kwa ile kategori ya magonjwa tunaita fungus na hizo kuna madawa kuna rust na pia kuna mafangas mbalimbali ambazo u, u, ushika majani ya spinach. Kwa hivyo ukienda pale kwa Agrovet unauliza dawa za fungus ama za rust. Na inakuja wakati wa hiyo mvua, yani hiyo wakati wa mvua, hiyo moisture ikiwa nyingi basi ile fungus inapata wakati mzuri waku wa ku multiply. E, zinaongezeka sana hiyo wakati na hiyo ndio wakati sasa inafaa unakuja na dawa, unapiga mara kwa mara. Kuna ile management ya dawa pia usingoje tu uone kuna ile tunaita preventive na kuna curative usingoje ukue mgonjwa ndio uende ukatibiwe hapo gharama itakuwa juu sana lakini mkulima ukiwa na program ya spring tuseme baada ya kila siku saba hii msimu wa mvua kuna hii changamoto ya rust unapiga dawa kila baada ya muda fulani hapo spinach yako itapata wakati mzuri sana wa kukua kwa sababu haina haina ugonjwa ambaye inairudisha nyuma Eh, hivi ikipata ugonjwa na unashinda ukitibu hiyo huwa inazuia matawi ama majani yake kufanya vizuri. Eh, yield yako itapungua, mazao yako itapungua kwa sababu kila wakati unaitibu unarudi ukitibu tu ugonjwa na ile ungezuia. Eh, ukizuia then mea yako inapata wakati mzuri wa kuzaa kutosha. Eh. Folia feed. Eh. No. There are some you can mix and there are some which like copper based uh, fungicides hizo hawezi changanya. Copper based it react na zile zingine inakuwa shida kwa mmea. Eh, itazuia hiyo hiyo uh, mbolea yako kuwa mbolea. It react. Because sasa umefanya vizuri sana. Sisi tukienda kwa Agrovet tunaambiwa he is it tatu ndio you don't waste time changanya zote and the biggest kuma wiki yako ama spinach yako so we got a good quality seed from simlo we've managed it very well ikifika ni hapa kwa madawa tunaambiwa tuchanganye zote that please repeat that it's very important hapo kwa madawa na kuna maelezo inakuwa kwa hiyo mapakiti ya dawa mara nyingi wakulima watusomi kwa sababu ya maandishi yake ni madogo na ni karatasi kubwa ambayo ukiambiwa soma wewe unatafuta njia ya rahisi na unachanganya kuna zile uh, fungicides ama hizo dawa za hiyo ugonjwa za matawi ambayo tumeongelelea ambazo ni copper based 
ikiwa na copper ukichanganya na na folia hapo sasa ume hakuna kitu umefanya eh hiyo dawa itaharibika hiyo 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 folia itaharibika hakuna uh, usaidizi utakuwa umefanyia mmea wako so una avoid copper based uh, fungicides na na folia feeds hizo usichanganya ile unaweza changanya ni pesticide ama na na na, na hiyo folia feed hizo zinaendanishana pamoja lakini ya muhimu zaidi ili mkulima usifanye makosa usichanganya eh, just don't mix if you can do it separately do it but kama unaelewa copper based fungicide hiyo ondoa kando na hizo zingine za za folia na yeah mm. you have no idea how you are helping people because the problem is eh, well, most of us who are, most, most of the people ambao wana to watch leo wako either in the diaspora ama uko Nairobi in the office you are sending your employee to go to the local agrovet kana pale kwa agrovet anaandikiwa na felt pen 20 ml in 20 liters or 10 ml in 20 liters ana uchanganyo upige dawa then jamaa anapiga dawa saa saba so hizo dawa zimekukosema 1500 ama 1000 haya ume mix zote mpaka hizo copper based alafu umepika saa saba then unakuja shambani unashindwa mbona mboga zako ama spinach zako zinafanya vibaya sana and this i think is what people need to hear this i think is one of the most important sound bite that do not mix copper based with your folias. Umasikia yeah. wakulima? Masaya yeah. kupiga dawa. Eh, tu usipige wakati jua inasimama. Either mkia mapema ama late in the evening kwa sababu ya mambo mawili. Ukipiga saa hizi mchana hiyo jua inapiga hiyo dawa wakati ume umenyunyuzia na chance ya hiyo dawa kuwa effective inaenda chini kwa sababu jua inaichoma na, na, na strong rays na hiyo dawa ina oxidize. Unapoteza. Ya pili hiyo masaa wadudu hawako kama ni wadudu umeweka pesticide pale hawa wadudu utapatana nao if it's a contact pesticide then dudu hatapatikana 